Hi, I'm Bridget Trelaw. I'm from Sydney Seafood School at Sydney Fish Market. And today we are really lucky to have Yoshi from Yoshi's Restaurant down in the Rock, Sydney, to talk about this fabulous fish, the Hiramasa Kingfish. So, Yoshi, what are we going to do with our Hiramasa Kingfish? Uh, just I now uh, take out the fillet. Yes, then, we're going to uh, fillet it. Sashimi. Yes. Oh, so we're going to do so the fillet through the sashimi? Watch, please, yes. Okay. Now, do you use the whole fish if you're making sashimi, or do you use certain parts of the, of the hiramasa? Uh, just uh, today, I just uh, uh, make it from the belly side. Okay. Yep. So you could use the belly side, which has got the higher fat content. Uh, yes. Or you could use the, the thicker part at the top, which has got not, not as much fat, but the whole fish is, is quite a, a, a yes. buttery yes. rich flavour from the... Um, all different flavours. All different flavours. Yes. Okay, off you go. So you're going to cut from the stomach down to the tail, yes? Yes. So keeping the knife up against the rib cage? Yes, touch the bone. Touch yep. the bone the whole time? Yes. And no sawing action, just one straight cut. Yes, no much. No sawing, okay. Beautiful. I change the knife. Change the knife, okay. So straight down the middle? Uh, yes. So use this part. So this is the belly part with the belly higher part. fat content? Yes. So this is the part that you tend to use in your restaurant or you use the whole? A uh, whole, we're oh. using whole, yes. So the knife just above the skin? Take out the skin. This. Very beautiful colour. Absolutely. It? So you've got some darker flesh at the top as well, so good contrast, but this will be a different flavour to the lighter yes. flesh underneath. This uh, uh, shining, this uh, silver part, mm -hmm. this is a very good nourishment. So we don't want to waste that? No waste it. A third yeah. knife. This is a sashimi knife. Sashimi <laughs> knife. So the idea of a long blade is so that it is one cut, is yes. that right? So cut across the grain? Yes. This is a keep. So quite thin. Is that because with the Hiramasa kingfish having more oil in the belly, yes. you make it thinner with a rich flavour? Yes. Uh, also, this side is uh, more that moving, so more muscly. Ah, because it's the tail section. Yes. So better the thin cut. Thin cut, so it's not as tough. Yes. So these pieces will be for sashimi? This is a sashimi as well. Just a different cut? Yes. We got a different texture to be more enjoyed to the customer. And that's because it's not the tail section? Yes. Okay. Uh, make a square. So you know exactly what size you're going to get? Yes. Never mistake. So you've got a nice block. So after if I made a cucumber. Imagine being able to do this. Okay, so one long continuous piece of cucumber cut yes. by hand with a very sharp knife. Need to sharpen. Don't knife. try this at home. <laughs> so you've soaked this in salted water? Salted water. So the equivalent of seawater? Seawater, the flavour, same. Okay, so if you do want to try this, 30 grams of salt to a litre of water would make sea salt. So. If we want practice, please come to my restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll have to all pop down to your restaurant if we can let you do this one. Uh, I can teach. Okay, so you just roll it up in your thinly sliced cucumber. Yes. And you could use something other than cucumber? Your uh, yes. daikon? Yeah, daikon we can yes. use. Your yeah. long white radish? Yes. So this you won't, don't want to be making early, this one you make 
as soon as you're ready to eat. Yes. So now is a decoration. So you just slightly stagger them? Yes. Beautiful. And you can see how firm the hiramasa is, that the, the flesh holds together very well, slices beautifully. And they also make a flower. So it's not going to fall apart. The flesh actually holds together very well, doesn't it? Ah, yes. Beautiful. Makes a wonderful flower. So we're taking the middle bits. This is for us to eat afterwards, is it? Yep. Lovely contrast there too. Carrot this is amazing. A butterfly. A, a butterfly made out of thinly sliced carrot. Beautiful. Just quickly to make a cucumber. So, okay, we're going to cut one end of the um, cucumber, a slice of, long slice of cucumber. So very thinly sliced at one end. Fan it out yes. and turn down every second one. So it makes a very yes. simple but very effective garnish, doesn't it? Yes. Just a little bit practice. Beautiful. Here we go. That so is like fantastic. So Yoshi, thank you so much. You make it look so simple. Now if you'd like some information, please go to our website, sydneyfishmarket.com.au and come and see Yoshi at Yoshi's Restaurant in the Rocks in Sydney with his Hiramasa Kingfish. Thank you, Yoshi. Thank you very much.